Bonjour and welcome back. I'm Aaron. Uh, and I'm Chloe. And together we are King Kingfisher Games. Games. Thanks for joining us. Uh, today we're going to be talking to you about this uh, kids game. It's Chloe's game. Uh, cat crimes. <laughs> uh, Chloe got this for Christmas or birthday uh, last year. I think my birthday. I think birthday as well. Yeah. Um, it's for ages eight plus. Uh, there's no time limit on it. It just kind of. It's a game where you get clues and just kind of take however long you need to solve it. Mm -hmm. So join us at the table to find out more. Here is the uh, player board. Um, and to set up the game, you need these six tokens. There is a fish, a knocked over fish bowl, a knocked over plant, a uh, yarn, an un, um, untangled yarn, a spilled coffee, um, disgusting juice, <laughs> and a empty bird cage, which I think one of the uh, players um, ate the bird. The tokens can uh, go on in a pile on the side uh, for now. Here is Pip Squeak. He's a cute little guy. Here is um, Mr. Mittens. Sassy. Here's Duchess. Um, in our uh, other uh, cat crime mini movie thing, um, I was Duchess, and I was the um, master of crime. Tomcat, who was also in the other video, he was um, working with the... Um, detective and uh, comment down below if you remember who was Tomcat and here is Ginger uh, also comment down below um, what I called her in the other cat crimes video the game comes with 40 crimes uh, ranging from beginner intermediate advanced and expert in this video we are just going to be covering scenario one for the beginner uh we are going to do beginner one who ruined the shoes so we're gonna take this token and see here it's these nice pretty shoes and cover them with these tokens they're double-sided cover them with the nasty shoes. Okay, so to play the game, once you have everything set up, we read through the clues and try to figure out which cat was in front of the token that we put down. So like Chloe said, we're trying to figure out who ruined the shoes. Our first clue is Mr. Mittens and Pipsqueak were upstairs sleeping. That means we can take Mr. Mittens, Pipsqueak, and remove them from the game. Next clue is Tomcat was sitting in front of the catnip and sock. So you take a Tomcat and look for the catnip and socks and you put a Tomcat right there. The third clue is Sassy was sitting across from Tomcat. So I'm gonna take Sassy. We already know where Tomcat was sitting. And I place her across. Uh, the fourth clue is Ginger was sitting next to the fishbowl. Um, and when they say next to, um, they mean either here or here. Let's put her here. 
The fifth clue is that Duchess was sitting to the left of Sassy. Looks like that's an L. So Ginger has to move to this side so that she's um, still next to the fishbowl. And Duchess goes here, making, because uh, the clue said she's to the left of Sassy. Uh, we think Duchess is sitting here with the token. So, um, so we're gonna flip the card over and um, see if we're correct. Looks like we are correct. So it looks like we have all the cats in the right spot according to the answer sheet. Um, so Duchess committed the, cr committed, committed the crime. So that's how you set up and play cat crimes. There are 39 other uh, crimes to be solved. Uh, we've done, I think, most of the green, most of the beginner ones. We've done a few of the yellow um, intermediate ones. Uh, we've started some advanced, but haven't touched the extra ones. Not yet. Yeah. Uh, but we did do like one and a half questions of one expert one, but I started going cuckoo. Yeah. Yeah, we uh, gave up on that one. Yeah, Went was, back to the advanced. I was moving, or intermediate. <laughs> I was moving the pieces around, going crazy. If you like to support our channel, like and subscribe for more board gaming content. We like to have fun here and we hope you do too. Giga Wabman Minowa, we'll see you again.